You got these little villagers, they tug at your heartstrings, they make you feel nice, and then look, they just leave a dirt patch. The shape of a house inside of your heart. Hey guys, it's Adam aka Swimming Bird, and welcome to Animal Crossing New Leaf. Today is the final bug off of the year, and I'm gonna do my best to try to get that spider clock that I need to complete the insect set. I'm gonna grab my letters as well. We've got, ooh, quite a few we need to read, jeez. We got Happy Home Academy stuff. I can leave these in here for a little bit. We're going to read a couple. Let's start with the one that I forgot to read last time. I've got this letter here with a gift from Genji. What's going on, Genji? Sup, Adam. Surprised to get a present out of the blue? I bought this and don't really use it, so I'm giving it to you. But it's not second hand. There's not a dent on it. Honest, from Genji. Okay, so Genji sent me something here. Let's grab it. Ooh, we got our uh, painting, it looks like, from, from last time as well. A vintage camera? That actually sounds pretty good. And it looks like Red has, uh, Red has sent us his amazing painting, the one that we just purchased. Okay, I'll have to donate that later. Today is all about bugs, though, and I need to keep my eyes open, because if I see any, we're going to need to catch them and steal them from the other villagers. This is the day when the villagers are really into catching bugs, because they obviously want to try to win the bug off as well. So let's go talk to Nat. And uh, we won't be seeing him for a while. It's going to be sad. He only shows up here. But we should have some fishing competitions here pretty soon. Ooh, there we go. Got a nice uh, monarch there. I'm not really sure how good those are. I have to kind of try to remember where they rank. Because different bugs get different grades. And uh, the rarer ones, obviously, are more desirable. There's a grasshopper here somewhere. I stepped on it. Sorry, little guy. I think it's another rice grasshopper. I just have to see. Oh no, it's a long locust. That's probably better than the rice grasshopper because it's a little longer. So I'm like trying to rank my different uh, stuff, like when to donate them, and because uh, you want to do it in order. Try to you know give Nat your your worst bugs first off because then you get the bit more prizes as you go because you keep beating your best score is the strategy. I only have one piece of bug furniture left that I need though because I did well in the other bug offs. I don't remember which monarch is longer. It's okay. As long as I can uh, can see what he's up to and uh, if he's got the right set for me. Hello, old bean. The bug off is underway. Would you believe this is the final bug off of the season? Terrible shame, but don't let it affect you. You have to do your very best. Don't let the day end in regret. Say now, are you punch hands here? I know the rules. I'm good. I've been to several. I have many gold trophies. <laughs> Then you know the drill. Gather some delectable insects and bring them back to me post haste. Okay, so I'm going to try to give him this red dragonfly because I think that's one of the lowest ones. They're really, like, gross. Not gross, but, like, ants and, you know, brown cicadas and flies and stuff are all in, like, the F category of, of bugs. I think this is, like, a D or so. A delightful red dragonfly. Yes, exquisite. So let's see if uh, we can beat him. So, yeah, there's two sets of, or actually, I think three different sets you can get from and if I it's all part of the insect set but if it's uh, if it's not the type of furniture that I want like it's not something from the uh, the little subset of it then we're not going to be able to get it this time which is sad oh nice we got first place nice okay so that's good for now what is he gonna give me something good oh jeez, a basketball hoop I thought that, uh, <laughs> we would get, I think you have to maybe score a G yeah, there we go. Yeah, you have to have at least 80 points, but at least I got a basketball hoop out of it. All right, I'm going to give him the rest of the bugs that I have here, and we'll see what we get. Okay, there we go. I gave him my rice grasshopper, and the first prize that we got for 90 points is the spiderweb clock, the one I'm missing. I wonder if my feng shui is, uh, is right, because he gave me the exact item that I wanted. That's crazy. I still have some more bugs to give him, though. But uh, let's see if I can get anything else good. But yeah, everything else would be a duplicate. So yeah, we've completed the insect set. I might theme a room after that. I was actually theme thinking about making like a Pikmin themed room, which I could use a lot of the insect stuff and uh, and some different designs I have. I have that one Snagrit thing on my wall, the one picture of a burrowing Snagrit. So yeah, let's see. I don't know if any of these are going to necessarily beat that. Ooh, this is a vibrant locust. But we can check out what else is going on. A lot of... Oh, 23. Jeez. Yeah, the monarchs did not score very well either. The, uh, but yeah, I want to see what other what the villagers are up to as well. A lot of them are probably going to be talking about the bug off, obviously, because I just saw, like, Graham, the little hamster guy, he's got his net. And we can read some more letters and stuff and see what else is going on. Everyone's caught up in the bug off excitement, but I don't care about the trophy that much anymore. I got my spiderweb clock, so 
So there we go. I don't know if he's gonna like these. Actually, this is the first bug off that I didn't like overly prep for. Usually I save up a ton of bugs. I'll have like tons of beetles and all this stuff. And that's how I got the rest of the furniture. And uh, th if they add an anything in the, uh, hopefully they'll add a lot of stuff in a newer version of Animal Crossing, like the Wii U one, I hope we're gonna get. But one thing that would be nice, if you could ex inspect your insects and have it tell you the size would be really helpful, because that's a thing with the bug off and the, I'm sure the fishing tournament when we get to that. You're gonna have, I like take pictures or write down notes of all of the different ones. Rofina's mad, look at her back there. She is just horribly ticked off from something. Did she lose a bug? Somebody steal it from her? Look at her, she's just brooding. She's like, oh, I hate bugs. <laughs> she's a chicken, so she's probably not the best, you know, in terms of loving insects. But Nat here is, uh, you know, he's a chameleon, so he's probably eating all these. That's the implied thing. Why are you so mad? Kiss me in my beak. No, <laughs> I dressed up with my little beak because I figured that would help me strike fear into the hearts of bugs that I need to uh, capture. Normally I avoid bugs, but today I want them all to flock to me. Come, my pretties. <laughs> Okay, she's not mad anymore. She kind of had enough time. Tangy, with her little fish smoke, is just, uh, she's not doing the bug off today. She's at home. Hello. Yeah, I'm not going to worry too much about uh, what we need to get. Because, yeah, I, like I said, I've got a gold trophy. I think I might have two of them. One time, I think I was beat out, but I don't remember for sure. I think I might have a silver. But, yeah, I've, uh, I've got the trophy to prove that I can catch bugs. You guys know. And I think having the complete insect set is nice in and of itself. Hey, Poppy's out here. I haven't seen him out and about yet. Hello, buddy. How's it going? His little, his version of the town tunes, like, whoa, whoa, which sounds like a weird, you know, ranch or something theme. A very peaceful, the bug off is in full swing here in Gooston. Have you caught any cool bugs, Adam? Me? I'm still getting warmed up, hey. <laughs> I don't know why that voice, it does not fit him at all, but... You know, it works, I guess. Let's see. Elvis, how you doing? Oh, we should read a letter. Elvis is hanging out over here. And there's Ribot. What's going on, buddy? I'm not going to talk to Ribot and kill my voice today. So let's sit down. Can we Can we actually sit when we read a letter? Let me check that out. I think you can go in your inventory, so I can probably sit here and see what... Uh, oh, we didn't actually pick up any more letters. Let me go grab some more. I forgot. We got to delete the ones that we've got in here. I don't really need my, my letter from Genji, even though he was very nice. And that one from Red. I'll grab some more letters. Uh, we can also go work at the cafe. I haven't done that in a long time. I'm not even going after these bugs. Let me go get that one. It's just a dragonfly. Actually, I should just uh, leave it because nothing is, you know, no dragonfly is going to beat what I got in there already. That's a peacock butterfly. They look more vibrant, don't they? Like, look how, it looks kind of like nice on its wings, but then when you catch it, look how like kind of washed out and pea green it looks. It's weird. It looks very different between the two models. Oh, look, these, I think, are these blooming more than they were before? I don't know, they might have the same little flowers. That bush is just, and it's rare. It's weird that some of the stuff in this game you only see, like, bloom for a very short period in the year. Stuff like that. Okay, let's read some more letters, and then maybe I'll finish up by going to work at the cafe. It's been a while since we've been there, and I have to remember all my coffee recipes. I have them written here still. Today's the day, Adam. It's to Oh, no. Oh, no. Genji, what? <gasps> Did he leave? Today's the day. It's time for me to say goodbye to this town and everyone in it. I'm gonna miss you guys. I made so many happy, sweaty memories here. Stay fierce. Sincerely, Genji. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Genji. Genji? <sighs> guys. He's gone. He's gone. I didn't even know he was leaving. And he's gone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I didn't have these emotes prepped or anything, but they're here. I'm so sad. I can't believe it. He was one of my favorites. Ugh. Ribot has the same per personality. Like, they're both jocks. But I would have rather had Genji stay. I can't believe... I didn't even know he was going to leave. Oh, There's a big fish in the water. Maybe that'll make me feel better. I'm so sad. Ah, uh, that means we'll get another new villager. But at the same time, Genji. I think he's been here from the start, right? I'm really sad. I'm like legitimately sad that he left. That is the that's what happens in this game. Ooh, we got a pike. Those are pretty rare, I think. Uh but yeah, you got these little villagers, they tug at your heartstrings, they make you feel nice, and then look, they just leave a dirt patch. The shape of a house inside of your heart. 
Uh, I'm gonna go jump off the cliff. No, <laughs> I can put my wetsuit on and jump down. I'm really sad though. Genji. Okay, well, you know, the, like I said, the upside, we have a new villager coming. I just threw away that letter from Genji, and I, oh, I regret it because <laughs> that was one of the last letters he'll ever send me. He sent me a letter and he gave me a vintage camera. Oh, I'm so, st I, I don't know if I can work at the cafe. I'm so distraught. Let's go check a, take, check a look. Let's go take a look at that vintage camera real quick because I want to see Genji's last gift to me. Also read this from Cranston real quick. Hey Adam, jeez, oh, he keeps telling me about his birthday. Okay, I know his birthday's on the 23rd. Okay, a couple more days actually, so we'll probably have to celebrate that soon. I gotta get him something. Maybe he'll like a vintage camera. Ah, Genji, all the good times we had. You were one of my favorites by far. Oops, didn't mean to lay down. No time to get depressed. I've got mayor's duties to do. I'm gonna drop this vintage camera real quick and uh, see what it looks like. If I have room in this cluttered area, really gotta reorganize my house here. So let's throw it down. What does it look like? Aww. I hope I can take a picture of my sad face with my new vintage camera. You know, I can actually click it. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna keep this because this... I don't want to forget Genji. And this was the gift from him to me. So I'm gonna leave it there. I can take a picture of my axe and my owl clock and stuff. Okay, guys, I'm sorry to leave this on a sad note, but like I said, we can get another villager now, but I, I like, I keep wanting, like, Pinky and Avery to leave, and then we got Genji. One of my favorites is gone. Uh, please leave a like if you enjoyed this. Make me feel a little better. Give me a thumbs up. Anyways, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Chin up, guys. There's always more to do in New Leaf. I'll see you then. Goodbye.